Good morning. Larry, you do realize now that we, this group of women you so heartlessly abused over such a long period of time, are now a force and you are nothing. I am here to face you, Larry, so you can see I've regained my strength, that I'm no longer a victim, I'm a survivor. I am no longer that little girl you met in Australia where you first began grooming and manipulating. Lying on my stomach with you on my bed, insisting that your inappropriate touch would help to heal my pain. The reality is you caused me a great deal of physical, mental, and emotional pain. You never healed me. You took advantage of our passions and our dreams. Imagine feeling like you have no power and no voice. Well, you know what, Larry? I have both power and voice, and I am only beginning to just use them. We will use our voices to make sure you get what you deserve, a life of suffering spent replaying the words delivered by this powerful army of survivors. I am also here to tell you to your face, Larry, that you have not taken gymnastics away from me. I love this sport, and that love is stronger than the evil that resides in you and those who enabled you to hurt many people. You already know you're going away to a place where you won't be able to hurt anybody ever again. But I am here to tell you that I will not rest until every last trace of your influence on this sport has been destroyed like the cancer it is. Abusers, your time is up. The survivors are here, standing tall, and we are not going anywhere. And please, Your Honor, stress the need to investigate how this happened so that we can hold accountable those who empowered and enabled Larry Nasser, so we can repair and once again believe in this wonderful sport.